नमस्कार टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू सॉल्व दिस क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम पी डी सो वी आर टू सॉल्व टी इक्वल्स टू टू आई स्क्वायर सो यू मस्ट बी थिंकिंग वट इज टी है यू आर नॉन टू टू आई स्क्वायर वाई इज अ वेरिएबल बट हाउ टू सॉल्व टी इक्वल्स टू टू आई स्क्वायर फॉर दैट यू नीड टू नो वट आर सम नोटेशन इन द वर्ल्ड ऑफ पी डी so those notations are your p is your del z by del x your q is your del z by del y your r is del 2 z by del x square your s is del 2 z by del x del y and your t is del 2 z by del y square so in the current question we are concerned more about this t which is del 2 z by del y square so if you plug in the value of t into our equation so we will get del 2 z by del y square equals to 2 y square now one after one we will remove this uh, del from the equation to finally get our z because this is written as uh, del by del y of del z by del y because if you open this you will get del 2z by del y square okay so this is the case now how to solve this first we will remove this del by del y okay and then we will remove uh, this del by del y so as to finally get this z okay so how to do that so if you integrate both sides with respect to y taking x as constant so if you do this operation what you will get one del by del y will get removed as i told you so you will get del z by del y equals now you are doing integration with respect to y so it will be integration of 2y square dy so del z by del y you are getting as 2 will come outside integration of y square you all know is y cube by 3 now because y x here is constant so the constant of integration which we always write as c in this case will be in terms of x which is f1 x okay now we have got this equation and as i told you you have to now remove this del by del y because this del by del y are already you have removed so if in order to remove this del by del y again again integrate with this Respect to y taking x as constant. So once you do so, what you will get? Uh, this del by del y will be removed. Now you will get simply z equals to integration of this and integration of this. So two by three, I am taking outside integration of y cube dy plus integration of uh, integration of f one x. This is an interesting case because f one x is a constant. So this is same as integration of two. So how you do integration of two? You take that two outside, so f one x I take outside, and integration simply of d y. And now in this integration also you will get a constant. Now again 
because x is treated as constant, so the constant of integration in this step will again be in form of x. F two x. Okay, fine. Let's simplify things up. So z equals to two by three. Integration of y two y power four by four. Okay, but as you can see that y power four we have no problem divided by four. So you can cancel this out so as to get uh, this two will vanish. This four you will get two in denominator. So I am simply writing three into two. Which is six. So y power four by six. From here, integration of dy is y. So y times f one x and plus simply your f two x. So this becomes your final answer. Z equals to y power four by six plus y times f one x plus f two x. So I hope you understood this question. There was uh, no problem. Uh, in solving this, uh, as I told you that this is of this form, t value you plugged in. Now you got this. So one by one we remove. So first we remove del by del y, then this del by del y. So in order to remove one del by del y, you have to integrate with respect to y once. In order to remove next del by del y, which was inside, again we integrate it because we took x as constant. So the constant of integration was also in term of x in both the cases. Okay, here x was constant, so it came out integration simply of dy. So it's a, again a pretty easy question to solve as far as PD is concerned, and this method is known as method of direct integration, solving PD by direct integration. You don't have to uh, bother about anything; just keep on integrating until you get your z. So I hope you understood it. Thanks and have a very nice day.